What's good fam? Today, look what I have. The Grasshopper Vaporizer. Now, we're gonna talk just basically all about this sweet vaporizer. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Um, it retails for 200 bucks. Let me confirm, give me one second. Um, I just wanna confirm this for you to make sure All right, I'll check it later. I'm not going to waste your time with that, but it's either, I'm pretty sure it's 200 bucks, and they have a titanium version also. Um, so let's, either way, in the description, I'm going to put uh, the price and where you can get it in case I'm making a mistake. It comes here in this cool box. It comes with the actual, I actually have mine charging over here comes with a vape with a, with a pen and this is look at the style of this uh, vaporizer it's so cool it's like a pen um, this actually used to be a Kickstarter project and uh, they got funded and you know obviously now they're in production um, what else does it come with it comes with this which is the charger USB charger and it comes with two uh, two batteries. Damn, I can't plug this in. Alright, I'm like retarded right now. There we go. Alright, so let's put this away. Alright, so the pen, it comes with two batteries. I actually have the other one over there. I'll show you what that looks like. Okay, comes with two of these, and you just plug them in with this cable over here. Goes at the end. Just screw this back on, <coughs> <coughs> and put that like that, and that's it. Pretty damn simple. That's how you charge it. Now. What do I want to talk about next? Um, yeah, okay, so let's actually smoke. Do a little session here. Show you how this thing works. So you just basically unscrew this top part. And let me clear that up. Here's the, the actual bowl. And now, one of the cool parts about this vaporizer, or one of the benefits, um, I've actually been fortunate to be able to test a lot of different vaporizers. And this one has a conventional oven, if I'm not mistaken. And um, <clears throat> the heat up time is like really, really fast. I, I it's definitely the fattest, fattest, fastest heat up time on any of the grinders that I have or that yeah that I've tried so let's go ahead and screw this on and on. alright so one thing that I didn't like about this and I saw other reviews and people other people didn't like this as well I mean again it's not a huge deal but uh, how you control the temperatures is right here with this this knob this you just twist this and um, there's no actual I don't know if you can see that so I go plus right there and then there's a minus over here and then there's these three damn I hope my computer doesn't die while I'm shooting this um, so that's how you control the temperatures I do mine at like one two three three and a half and it goes up to five um, so how you turn it on you just click this see these blinking lights it's red you gotta wait till it turns green sorry blue and there you go ready to go Uh, 
and it shuts off on its own if it's not in use. So that's, I guess, it's good for me. All right, let's do another. Now, one of the one of the complaints about this vaporizer is that it gets too hot, and since the the oven or the the yeah the oven, I guess you can call it the chamber where it heats up the earth is really close to your lips. Yeah, just turned off again. Um, it's really close to your lips, so. They include the silicone, silicone tip, which is very, very useful. I don't know if you can see that the vapor. Um, my low on battery. Oh no, that's there we go. I don't know if you guys can see that. Right, so what the problem was, I was like, how come I'm not getting that that much vapor? And it's uh, because I'm I'm used to my other vaporizers where you have to um like take like like very small, long, slow draws. With this, you can just take a big rip. Actually, you can. And I'm not doing it. I'm doing it like at three, three and a half, which is, in my opinion, where you get the best taste. Three, three and a half on the temperature. Uh, but you can do four, four and a half, and you're going to get a lot more vapor. But personally, I just like uh, three and a half, somewhere around there. So that pretty much wraps up this review, guys. Um, overall, like I, I'm gonna, I definitely rank this in the top three favorite, uh, especially for portable use. And it's 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 so discreet, you know. You can literally take this everywhere. So it's definitely my go-to um, on-the-go vaporizer. Now another thing that I've seen in other YouTube videos, which I haven't personally tried, but I definitely will is uh people using this with glass pieces like bubblers and stuff and that and it works amazing for that as well so uh i'll definitely be doing uh, a video uh testing this with a glass piece in the coming weeks hopefully you enjoyed this review and overall i give this a uh two thumbs up um if you want to get this vaporizer you can get it at the link below um, you can also watch the full uh, blog post review. And um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. Stay high, my friends. Peace.